Well, 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 good morning, sorry friends. And I do say good morning. It's after 12 now. April 1st, give God glory for life, health, and strength for as well as it is. Give him all the glory. I also want to thank the End Time Harvest Game, well, YouTube family, Blog Talk family, everyone. Uh, we hope everybody had a happy resurrection day. I, was, I spent most of my day in church and uh, we had a musical and had some churches to come together. And, uh, Pastor Ham, Pastor David Ham, Pastor uh, Piney Grove Missionary Baptist Church as well as the Samix Gift Baptist Church and uh, we also have a church in Smithville and we had all three of the choirs today to come together, fellowship program and had another uh, minister of music to come in and uh, guess and uh, we had a real good time. I was so glad that I have love to play with other people. I love to play with other musicians. It takes a load off sometimes you can get a little load off yourself. And so we really had an enjoyable time. And we thank God. And like I say, I thank God for everyone, uh, all the ones. Uh, matter of fact, I, I've got uh, 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 messages uh, from uh, Sister Lady D and uh, Maria and everyone, uh, JT, uh, all the, the Brother L.A., uh, just about everybody, you know, the whole gang. So I heard Sister Maria do some singing, and we are uh, glad to hear that. Great voice, Sister. Keep it up. I wish you were closer. We would try to do some, some, some recording. But at any rate, we just still got to get to be about our Heavenly Father's business, people. Things are going on in this world. There's a lot of stuff going on right about now. I'm quite sure y'all been watching the news. You know, there's nothing for no one to get along about. But we know that thus, thus said the Lord, we cannot change it. Only thing we got to do is just get ourselves prepared for whatever comes. And we are victorious. We are more than conquerors. We know that. And I was so glad I saw the video of Brother L.A. that you put up about this Easter thing. And I, I'm, I'm with you on that, brother. We need to teach the kids. I'm not against them having a little fun with a little egg coloring or whatnot, but we need to teach them about the real meaning behind the resurrection. Because if there's no resurrection, our, 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 our stuff is in vain. We might as well forget all this stuff and they're going to do whatever we want to do because tomorrow we all die. So we need to teach people about the resurrection and about the blood, the blood of the Lamb. That blood is so powerful. And we need to teach people about using the blood and pleading the blood, applying the blood. You know, with that being said, we just need a man want to know, let everybody know that. I, I, matter of fact, I just got a, had a chance to get back on the internet about an hour ago. We had some very, very bad weather over here. After, after about seven o'clock, the bottom fell out. I mean, thunderstorm, lightning, and I had to unplug everything. So, but we thank God. I think it has passed over to a degree. Some, some of it still in the forecast, but nevertheless, though. We will see, but we're just saying that we just we thank God for everyone, and uh, we hope that everybody uh, is uh, gonna we gonna we thanking God for letting us see another month. You know, April just come in here about uh, thirty some minutes ago, and we are seeing the first day of April. April that people call April Fool's Day, but in summertime, the way we the way we look at our world, it seems like a lot of more Fool's Day be going on in all the other time of the year too. Not only on April first. But at any rate, we just thank God. You know, we're gonna keep praising and keep lifting Him up. You know, just taking it one day at a time, people. One day at a time. We can't live too many. Just live it one day at a time. So with that said, bitty man, just letting everybody also know that I did, I, I did finish the project of the traditional hymns, and uh, we were, we are proud of it. You know, we had our brother Richard Butler out of out of Maryland, Baltimore. Uh, that, that's up there close around your neck of the wood, brother L.A. And, uh, we had him and did an awesome job, in other words. And I had a, a, another guy that played the guitar on it from Israel, Ben Shira, Ben Hira. And uh, we, uh, I'm, I'm going to try to post their names up, their proper names, and uh, maybe, maybe perhaps tomorrow sometime. Uh, I'm going to try to go and give everybody a shout out as well as uh, Didi. Uh, a partner of mine up there in Virginia, Exmoor, Virginia. And uh, Didi also played some organ on some of the tunes on there. And I think I 
I think I did pl place that in the project. And if I didn't need it, I'm sorry, but I think I did. At any rate, we just said we just want y'all to just check out the project. Let me know what you think. Comment if you can. Send me an email. Drop me a line. Let me know if what I'm doing right or wrong. Whatever it is, is I, I welcome all comments. Because if I'm doing something wrong, I need to know so I can get it right. And if I'm doing something right, the encouragement will be beneficial. So with that being said, this middle man saying, whatever you get, whatever you get into, if God's not in it, that you come out of it. This middle man saying, peace. Goodbye.